Stan, here we are in the loft. Thank you very much. So, being out for the family thing, local pub, uh, just for some dinner, breakfast actually, it was uh, there at 10 o'clock. And one of my relatives said, There you go, that's for you. So, that's the Lancers. I think it's the 12th Lancer, 12 Lancers. He said they don't exist anymore. I don't want to bend it. I think it was plastic or bimetal. It's a nice little item. He also. Another one of my relatives gave me this, should I say. Now that is obviously a police cap badge. That is the local police. They are not called Claven Constabulary anymore, which I didn't realise. They are now called... What? Dropped on the floor, that's what they're called. <coughs> they are now called Claven Police. They were called Claven Constabulary. So I'm not sure how old it is. Obviously it's Queen's Crown. Claven, as we covered in another video, didn't appear on the radar until 1974. So that's not a current one, it's defunct. So that's a nice one for the small collection of um, police items I've got. So on eBay the other day, I saw a lot of these. Uh, it was a job lot of uh, Soviet medals and I'm not going to go all the way. They actually are interested in their own right, which I possibly could do another video on. But whether I do or I don't, you know you know what I'm like. Uh, I thought I'd just get them all together because I'm going to have to mount up some sort of display. I've got my East German sections now I've got 15, actually 14, uh, there's one of them is East German medal. I've got a lot more Soviet medals and really deserve display case. So I've written down possibly underneath a couple of places what they, what they might be just for memory's sake. So we'll try and work through what they are. So these bottom two here, I'll hold one up. I've written underneath. So this is for impeccable service. See that? And on the back, it's... 20 years the other one is 10 years so it says impeccable service in the kgb or armed forces above it is a, it's a russian medalist not a soviet one and this is the yogi zukov zukov second world war general this medal so that's from 1896 date of his birth 1996 uh, again that's awarded the russian forces for you know different acts of uh, heroism, etc. I'm not going to go too much into it. The one at the top here, this is 1870 to 1970, and this is the Jubilee anniversary, 100 years of Lenin's birth. Again, that's a Soviet one. This one here, probably got a bit of writing underneath, 100, 1500th anniversary of Kiev. Kiev, or Kiev as they're calling it now. So that's quite a poignant one. Now, I'm, that is a Soviet medal, I'm presuming. This one oops, is 1918. I'll have to have a look. To 1968. I think that's 68. And that is uh, the celebrating the uh, formation of the Soviet Armed Forces. In 1918, obviously after the revolution, this one's the same. This is 1918 to 1988. On the reverse, obverse, 70 years. There's two of those that came in it. And it was a job lot. 1918 to 1978. Very stylized Soviet communist medal. This very nice indeed. Top one's quite interesting. Let's move that. This is the same type of medal. 40 years of the celebration of the um, Soviet formation of Soviet Armed Forces. That's 1918. It's 1958. We come on this side. 1945 to 95. That's obviously 50 years of the Great Patriotic War, since the Great Patriotic War doubled up on that one. This one, I was unsure. Uh, it's blank on the back. I was unsure about that one. So anyone's got any thoughts on that? I don't speak Russian. Still looks nice. Uh, top one, 1945, 1975. Again, the end of the Great Patriotic War, 30 years. 
And finally, this is the Disting Distinguished Service Medal. I think it's Distinguished Service Medal for the NVA Armed Forces. And I don't know if I've already got one of them. I'll have to check my cabinet. But that'll be going in my collection. You can see that. NVA. So, there you go. A uh, like, nice little job lot of uh, items there. And they cost me... I think it was £29, £3 postage, something like that. So just over 30 quid. So if you work out there's 15 medals there, a little over two pound two pound a medal. That's not a bad little haul, really. Um it gives me the options of uh, of trading out or, or passing on uh, the gifts for people uh, where I've got where I've doubled up or I'm sure. I don't know just looking at my little cabinet there. I'll have to check my cabinet downstairs whether I've got I've got already got one of those if I haven't. I'll be keeping that. So that's Stan. Uh, and that is my little haul of um, Soviet medals. How to find somewhere to display them. So this is Stan. And I will see you.